Want to learn how to create a cool player ranking for your videos? Don't miss this tutorial. Before we begin, don't forget to hit the notification bell and click the subscribe button, so you're always updated on our latest video releases. Let's start by opening Filmora 10. First, I need a video game competition background. Go to the split screen tab, select the split screen format you like the most, and drag it into the first timeline. The preview window has placeholders where you can add your video clips. Let's drag the video I prepare. You can adjust the size and position in the preview to make it look neat. Now let's add the green screen footage. Click on the media tab and drag the green screen footage into the second video track. Double click to open the editing menu and check the chroma key box. Use the eyedropper tool to select the green to key out the background. Don't forget to arrange the placement of your green screen video to leave space for the text board. Next, go to the Titles tab and choose a text board under the gaming pack. And drop it onto the third video track. Remember that you can download this pack and more at filmstock.wondershare.com. You can adjust the position and scale together by using the Title Group Controller. Let's look. There is still some room for improvement. Let's create a transition for the character. Go to the Elements tab and select an Energy Wave animation under the Elemental Energy pack. Place it above the character clip and change the size and position to just cover the character. To finish, let's add a transition to end this video. Click on the Media tab and pick black color mats in the color menu and drop it at the end of the green screen clip. Extend the background length to match the black section. Then go to the Transitions tab and drag a transition between the green screen and color mat clip. We're done! It was easy. Thank you for watching! Remember, if you have any questions or problems that affect your editing process, leave them in the comments below. I may answer your question in our next tutorial.